G'day folks, Brian here. First time video for the Stabycraft fan page, but really excited to be bringing it to you today. So I took delivery of uh, my 1850 Frontier a couple of weeks ago. Been out in it about five times, I think, in the last couple of weeks, based in Melbourne, Victoria. So uh, we've, we're on parole at the moment, and uh, with easing restrictions allows us to, to get out a lot more so um, yeah, I thought I'd uh, run through some of the features and options that I have on the boat and, uh, and hopefully you, uh, you all enjoy my dodgy camera work. So let's get into it. So I've got a fairly standard Dunbeer roller trailer, really easy to, to drive on and off. Uh, got a single axle because I park it into a pretty tight spot. Um, so it's just much more easier for, for maneuverability. Got the boat catch here, great for launching and retrieving solely. Um, bit of a game changer with a young family and young kids. Electric anchor winch, again, so easy to do it on your own. Um, here I've got the, the, uh, the electric motor plate. I have ordered a, a Minn Kota, which is due in March, thanks to the coronavirus delay, but that uh, looking forward to getting the old spot lock uh, on that, seen from a previous post, I made some rod holders for when I get back, wash them all down. But we'll start at the back. So I went with the 115 horsepower Yamaha. Big fan of Yamaha. Reliability, power, you name it. Let's face it, they're all good engines these days, but uh, stick with what you know. Garmin transducer. Under here, we've got the, uh, the underwater disco lights, nice and blue. Probably look like a complete slog out on the water, but uh, you know what, I like them. Um, probably my favourite option is the uh, the dive ladder, and uh, certainly not a diver, never will be a diver, but um, the ease on which you can actually climb in into the boat uh, when you're out of the water, it's uh, quite amazing. So we've got the straight into the bait station, rod racks or rod holders, access to the uh, to the uh, live bait tank lifts up <clears throat> love these seats in the corner good to step up fold up and get nice and tight in the uh, in the corners um, as you'll see went the u-deck flooring really thrilled with this option so nice under your feet so cool so comfortable uh, really really thrilled with that stabycraft x s gear chili bin whatever you want to call it nice space for drinks and food and bait um, <clears throat> got the additional sort of stainless steel rod racks here. They're movable. Uh, when I got them, I put some foam on the back so it sits out. Uh, the rods sit out more vertical. Got the deck wash. Uh, all my little bits that I can just pull out, wash down really easily. Moving up to the, the helm station where the magic happens. Uh, <clears throat> got the, the fusion sound system on the side. Got the anchor switch, got the uh, 12 volt USB charging ports, got the hydraulic steering, the Garmin VHF, the Fusion Radio, the Yamaha digital gauges, the, uh, the compass, uh, another switch panel, got the cockpit lights, which are so all underneath the gunnels here all along. They, um, they light up at night with a switch, I should have showed you. This option too, just on the back bait, it, uh, red one side, white the other, another ripping option. Um, got the aerials either side of the the, uh, the helm station. The uh, So I've got two nine inch um, ultra high definition Garmin's here, and uh, they're both networked together along with the uh, along with the seven inch that you can see up the front. The beauty of this, I drive standing up, look straight down, see the maps, got the sounder here when I'm standing at the back, got the sounder, see, uh, see what's on there. <clears throat> Someone sitting at the front or if I'm casting from the front, got the front, uh, got the front sounder. Um, instead of the casting deck, cause I've got a young family and uh, we also plan to do some water skiing, I went the extra uh front console seat rather than a casting deck but i can stand on this area to cast as well 
um, store my life jackets, very comfy seat. Uh, so you've got plenty of, plenty of room around the boat. These grab handles are really good when driving, but uh, also love the color. Orange is my favorite color. And, uh, and so far, absolutely thrilled with the, uh, with the boat, the way it operates, the, the, uh, the sounders, the setup, um, can't complain. And uh, the guys down at MI Marine who, uh, who I ordered this through have been absolutely terrific through the, uh, the, I guess, the design and the delivery during what was an impacted uh, COVID time, but they were, uh, they were super. Anyway, that's it for now. Um, as I said, if you've got any comments or questions, fire away. Happy to help out with anyone thinking of, uh, of buying a new, new boat. Can't talk about the uh the team highly enough anyway thanks bye for now